So when then was the idea formulated to tie this into the 16 days of activism campaign and the fight against gender-based violence in yeah. South Africa, which we know has yeah. been plaguing the country for a very long time now yeah. and needs to be dealt with? No, absolutely. I mean, even the president, when he, you know, mentioned in the State of the Nation address, you know, it's, it's, it's scary numbers around the issues of violence. I think because we are a township-based school, you know, these are some of the challenges that these young people are going through, and one of them is violence in their own communities, mm -hmm. right? And uh, we wanted to say, you know, what can we do with these young individuals? Because if we don't get young people participating in um, issues that uh, impact our country, you know, we have to ask ourselves, what kind of country are we then building? And uh, we wanted to pass the bait in one. We wanted to do skills development, I think number two. We wanted to create an opportunity where young people get to actually work and get jobs, opportunities. And from there, it's the same as market access. And that's why then different partnerships had to be formulated in order for us to ensure that we partner with different media houses uh, to get the messaging out. Then these young filmmakers um, in 2019, um, 92 of them uh, came up with uh, 16 different stories. Mm -hmm. We're dealing with different themes around the LGBTQI plus community, um, crime against uh, women, against young men. And uh, these particular themes created such a big conversation. And we wanted to, you know, reawaken the, this campaign again in 2023. Mm. Well, you spoke about a, a number of filmmakers that came forward. How then did you uh, prioritize who should be included here and yeah. whose short stories need to be told? Because I'm, I'm sure cutting down yeah, yeah, and, yeah. and coming up with 16 wasn't an easy task. No, it really wasn't. Um, and I think, you know, every filmmaker always believes that the idea is great. Yes. Uh, but we also have to give them an opportunity because we work with industry facilitators. We worked with Bongi Ndaba, you know, who's a well-known script writer. Uh, Vuyani Bila himself, he's a producer. So these are individuals that we trust um, their wisdom in understanding uh, what a good story will be.